So we are looking at this question concatenation of array and the question is given an integer array in terms of length and you want to create an array answer of length 2 and where answer i equals equals nums i and answer i plus n equals equals nums i for 0 is less than equal to i uh, where i is less than n 0 indexed. Specifically answer is the concatenation of two nums arrays return the array answer. And we have an example here. So if we have the nums array that has elements one to one, what we are pretty much doing is we would have the elements one to one, and then we would have the same elements in the same order uh, after that. So we would have one to one and one to one. And we have another example right here. Uh, we have one, three to one, and we have one, three to one right here. And we have the same elements in the same order again, which is one, three, Two, one. Uh, there are two different ways to do this. Uh, first, we will look at the we will look at the longer way. So we will do answer equals list. Uh, so we will initialize and declare our list, and then what we will do is we will traverse through all of the elements that we have in the nums list and append that to the answer uh, list that we just created. So we will do for num and nums, and then we will do answer dot append and uh, this will append and uh, add all uh, it will append the elements uh, into the answer list that we just created uh, so it will go through and it will add one two and one and that's all we would have at this point right now and then what we will do is we will have the same we will have the same two lines that we just wrote out. Uh, wrote right here and then we will do for num and nums again and answer dot append and then we will do num and what the second uh, for loop will do is it will go through the list again and will start adding uh, inserting or appending one to one or if you're looking at this the first for loop will append these one three two one and then the second for loop will append uh, these one three two one and then we will just return answer and this looks good and this also looks good so for space complexity and time complexity we are looking at on uh, for space complexity it's on because we are adding as many elements as there are in nums uh, even though we're adding twice as many as there are in nums uh, but it's still considered uh, ON and for time complexity we are also looking at ON because uh, we have two for loops uh, but we are only traversing through as many elements as there are in uh, nums it doesn't increase um, our computation so if we had uh, uh, let's just say 5x more elements in nums then uh, our time of course it would increase by 5x uh, but it would still be considered on now we will look at the shorter approach and uh, for that what we will do is we will have nums and then we will multiply that by two so we will have asterisk and then we just do return answer and what this will also do is it will create the nums array and then uh, have uh, I will create the duplicate of that after that. So as you can see that this also works.